Hello children, I welcome you all once again to your English class. I hope you all are doing great. Children, for today's English lesson, we are going to continue with the active and passive voice chapter from your Mastering Grammar book. And in our previous video lesson, we have already finished uh, this exercise N and we had begun uh, knowing about the sentences which will be in, which will be starting with let okay so we had seen that when in active voice we use let like if we say let him book the tickets so you can see that the tickets will be coming will be taking the place of this uh, subject let the tickets let remains there only children you won't change its position okay so let the tickets be booked by him now close the window let the window be closed yes Throw the garbage in the dustbin, let the garbage be thrown. So also for commands children, we use the word let. Okay. So now in this video lesson, we are going to start with this exercise O, which is on page number 122 of your book. We write the following sentences in the passive voice and change the tense form of the verbs accordingly. Okay. He founded this institute last year. So let's write this one down. Okay. Number one. So this is this exercise is one hundred and twenty-two. Now, number one. He founded this institute last year. This institute. Institute was founded by him last year. Number two, they built this hospital in 1985. Now this hospital is our object here. So this hospital was built by them in 1985. So all these phrases children last year in 1985 will remain where it is supposed to remain. That means in their places only. Now the minister distributed food packets to the flood victims. So food packets were distributed. Food packets were distributed to the flood victims. by the minister number 4 the policeman caught the thieves the thieves because it's plural that's why you have to change the verb here auxiliary the police uh, the thieves were caught by the police. Now number five. The baker had baked cookies. So the cookies Baked is past, so was baked by the baker. Number six. The old man was making kites. 
was making is their children so kites were being made being made by the baker yes now number 7 she will make a greeting card okay a greeting card for simple future we will be added a greeting card will be made by her she becomes her okay children now number 8 the iron smith has been making iron tools okay iron tools iron tools iron tools have been have been made made by the iron smith okay now number 9 the boy had eaten an egg okay had eaten is there so an egg had been eaten by the boy Yes, sure. So we have full stop here at the end of each one. So we have done till nine. I hope you finish this, and now I can move ahead with the next. Number ten. A little lamb had followed Mary. Mary had been followed followed by a little lamb. Now we are done with this exercise. Let's see what we have next. Okay, so we have eleven and twelve as well. Let's finish that. Mother was knitting a sweater yesterday. A sweater. Was being knitted. Knitted by. Mother. Yes, and number two. John gets rolled out to a night table. So, out to a night table. Was written by. John Kits. Okay, children. Now let's move ahead. Transformation of interrogative sentences into passive voice. So we have learned, children, the transformation of imperative sentences into 
passive now we are going to learn about the interrogative one now did you eat the apple children the first thing is to identify the subject we are talking about whom we are talking about you and what is the object here so our object is apples so the action is done by you and action is done on the apples that means you are eating apple now see because we have to take object so we have to start with an auxiliary verb here so this becomes what were see this did you eat the apples were the apples because apples are our things object were the apples eaten by you because we can see did is simple past did tells us what about simple past that's why we have to use where as the auxiliary and eaten will be there as the main verb so see here some examples have you washed the dishes have the dishes been washed by you now the verb did it changes to were eaten auxiliary verbs do does did change to is are was were in passive voice now what have we done we have used this have has been plus the past participle form of the verb now did you use the set of binoculars now set of binoculars is singular children so was will be used with it was the set of binoculars used by you does she make garland now garlands are things so are garlands made by her now when a question begins with who what or whom which so we uh, we ask questions like we retain the question word and a preposition usually by is used like If I said who broke the cup, who broke the cup? See here, the cup is the object here, so it will come here. But we will be retaining the question word, and generally we add by with whom. Okay, so by whom was was will be there. By whom was the cup? and then we take the third form of broke which is break which is broken so by whom was the cup broken okay see here when did you complete your work so when was the work completed by you now change the following into passive voice we have set of questions in exercise 3 we are going to solve it now this exercise p this is on page number 123 number 1 which house did they paint so which will remain there which house was painted by them okay question mark now number 2 when did you eat breakfast now when remains when only when was the breakfast eaten by you question number 3 did you post the letter now for the letter is it is a thing was the letter because we are talking about a thing was the letter posted by you Number four. Did Kirit take all the books? Yes. Were all the books taken 
by Kirit. Does he recite poems? Okay, children, wait. I think I just skipped something. Okay, I skipped number three. So this, these are four and five. Now let me write three. Who threw the ball at Nita? By whom? Was Nita thrown a ball at? So, by whom was Nita thrown a ball at? Number Four is done, five is done, number six. Did, uh, okay, this is six only. This was four, number five. Does he like movies? Are movies? Liked by him. Question number six, seven. Does he recite poems? Are poems recited? by him number eight who composed this song by whom because whenever you see who you have to change it to by whom by whom was this song composed Okay, children, please copy this and please also note the number because there was this missing number. So I have written it correctly now. 1, 2, 4, 6, 3, 5, 7, 8. Okay, now we can move ahead. See this exercise cue. Read the following passage and fill in the blanks with the passive form of verbs given in brackets and make delicious sandwiches at home. Fresh, uh, fresh slices of breads are taken. Butter, okay, butter is, butter is bread. Okay, now this one, Q, which hundred and twenty three maybe. Butter is spread on the slices. Cucumbers and tomatoes are washed before they are peeled. Are washed before they are peeled. Yes. The slices are placed. The slices are placed. On the buttered slices, the edges of the bread slices are cut. Are cut. After salt and pepper are sprinkled. After salt and pepper, yes, it is sprinkled. The sandwiches are eaten fresh. Or are packed. Okay, 
children so we are done with this exercise and with this we have finished the chapter okay now in our next video lesson we are going to complete our future tense okay so do join me in your next video lesson we are done for today please take care of yourself and your family bye bye for this day